All right, we're back with Endara Gaming, where we beat the games playing Silent Hill 2 on my PlayStation 3 Silent Hill Anniversary Collection. Silent Hill 3, I guess there's options. That's credits. So we're getting Silent our, our Halloween gaming started off right with Silent Hill. We're, we're going to rip through tons of awesome horror games uh, in the next two months. Let's go. New voices, original voices. Hmm, interesting. Let's go with new voices. I did beat this game uh, around the time it was released when I was a teenager, but I haven't played it since then. All right. I figured I'll probably play this game to about 10 o'clock and I go to bed because I have uh, work tomorrow. But. Main scenario, sub scenario. Hmm. Well, that's all about. Well, let's just do main scenario. Letter from Silent Heaven. Action level, normal, easy, easy beginning, and riddle level. Let's do normal, and riddle level normal. Now we probably will be using um uh, a little bit of a guide when we get stuck, and this is the kind of game where you do get stuck pretty often, I think. Tank controls. It's a pretty dirty, pretty dirty bathroom, I gotta say. I don't have a map of this area. Pretty creepy looking. Looking for her. There's 
special place. What can she mean? This whole town was our special place. Does she mean the park on the lake? We spent the whole day there. Just the two of us, staring at the water. Hmm. Could Mary really be there? Is she really alive? Is this the same music that was in the original, I wonder? I really don't remember. It was so long ago when I played this. I kind of do remember, like, the scene, though. Vaguely. Yeah, I think I only beat this game once. Pretty hard to control your character. I should use the analog stick instead of the, uh... Got a map of Silent Hill. Observation deck, Pleasant River, Waltz Road. So most of this game, Rosewater Park, from what I remember, most of this game just takes place inside an insane asylum. Musen Park, I think you might go, you might end up going there. Yeah, you know, I think most of the, the, or maybe not a insane asylum, but a hospital. And I'm pretty sure it's where like most of the game takes place, from what I recall. Well, it was so long ago, last time I played this. So it seems like the X button interacts with stuff. I can't even go up there. Weird. Yeah, the controls are really not great. But, I mean, it's tank controls. That's, that's how they roll. Doesn't look like there's anything over there. Alright, I guess we'll go down this uh, area over here. Turn up the volume a little bit for me. Because I got this loud ass fan on my PS3. It's blasting. Yeah, so a lot of the areas you can't like walk into. But, hmm. It's kind of hard to see. Creepy. Can't see shit. All right. Oh, that's pretty cool looking. The music's creepy. Oh, we got over here. Well. Something in the well. What is that? Looking at this makes me feel like someone's groping around inside my skull. It gives me a weird feeling. Oh. 
Ne? Is a save point. We haven't even done anything yet. Yeah, so there's not a lot of like weapons and combat and stuff like that. This game has it, but it's not really what this game's about. That's creepy as hell. All right. Took a little bit of messing around, but yeah, con these controls are kind of rough. Did she say what her name is? Oh, nothing. She's quiet here, huh? I don't think she did. I guess. All right. Uh. This is pretty creepy. Like some kind of house. I just remember this game being in the hot, like a hospital for the whole game. I don't really remember this part too well. I'm guessing this is like a short part of the game. the right way or uh actually i think it might be the way i came from let's go back this way mm. oh, not that way can't see shit 
That's like water, like a little like pond or something. Is this the way I came? Ah, shit. I don't know. I'm not sure. I can't tell if this is the way I came or if this is the new a new way. Well, I think this is new. It doesn't seem like I could do anything with that car. What the hell's that noise? Silent Hill Ranch. I guess that's where we were. Oh, wait a minute. There's like an ambulance or something there. I didn't find that when I was in there. Yeah, well, hopefully it's not important. Like I said, I may use guides whenever I get lost a little bit, but... I'm gonna try not to, like, super rely on the guides. If I can help it. I mean, I guess we'll see where we go. Want to go up this mountain thing? I don't know. I guess I can't. Not an option. kind of like power station or something it looks like the visibility here is not great can I can I up the um brightness yeah it's, it's kind of hard to see oh god this is as bright as it goes Oh, man. Creepy, but all right. Confused. So I think that's the way I came from. I'm not sure. creepy place, but there's like nothing here so far.
The Roadrunner? This kind of reminds, reminds me of um, Dark Anthology, Dark Pictures Anthology, A Little Hope, where you just spend a lot of time walking around on roads. But in that game, more stuff happens than what's happening here. But you spend a lot of time in that game as well, just walking around. On these spooky roads. It's garbage. Okay. Oh, whoops. Looks like we're going towards a dead end, but that might be fine. Because there might be, like, something here. Items or something. Or just a dead end. Uh, yeah, it actually looks like there's nothing here. Hmm. What about this payphone? No. Or this table. What? Said something. Did I pick something up? I think I did. I think I just picked up our first aid kit. Nice. Flower shop? Can't go in. Alright. Sanders Street. Oh, there's a door. Are oh, you not gonna let me go in here? I thought for sure I'd be able to go in here. Nope. Oh, that's too bad. A little optional store would have been something pretty cool. But that's alright. Sure I'm going the right way. Yeah. So I bang a left here to the dead end and see what's there. Probably. Are these marks blood? Oh, what the fuck is that? We don't have any weapons or anything, so let's not go that way. I think this is the way we want to go anyway. Yeah, so we'll just go down standard Sanders. Shadow bothers me. What was that? Oh, do I have to chase it? It looks like I have to chase it. All right, I guess we're chasing it. The hell did it go? Oh, this goes... Oh, Ridgeview Medical Clinic. I think that's where most of the game takes place. That must be it. So, let's definitely go this way. That doesn't look right.
Another gate. Yeah, it's not bad. What's up? I know. Is that why your hair's all wet? What, uh, you got her costume? What'd you get her? That's what grandma said. What the hell is that? Well, that's it. She can't have belly shirts. No. They don't need that. What button do I press? Well, no. What the hell? Alright, see ya. Button configuration. What button attacks? I can't even read what this says. Enter, skip, action is X, run guard is square, aim is R2, so I guess X? Item is start? Aim, then accent, and R2, then X. Okay, thank you. No! R2 the next. Dude, let me out of here. What's up, babe? Daddy's playing a, a scary game. You want to see it? Oh, cool. Oh, I killed the thing easy. Come here. It's fine. Come here. That was actually pretty cool, but that was really scary trying to figure out what I was supposed to do. Is there something to find in here, or did I just come here to... What? Dead? Could it have been that creature? What's going on in this town? I guess there's like a person there or something? I can't see at all. Weird. That's pretty creepy. I'm not gonna lie. I'd better take it anyway. I might need it. Wow, 
these controls are rough. You definitely have to use the analog stick. Oh wait, I go in here. No, I can't. I mean, I I can't even see. I don't think so. Was that like a dead end, that red, like, spray paint thing? That looks pretty cool. Oh, there we go. I think that red thing's a save point, but it might be like a consumable. Like, if I use it, it might, like, disappear. I'm not sure how the saving works. But I have a feeling if I use it, it's gone. I mean, if there's nothing else here, I'll just save. Well, I guess there's nothing else here, so... Fine. Parking lot. I think I already tried to go in there. Come on, bitch. Oh, shit. He's got a range attack. They just keep getting up. I think they just keep getting up. Fudge. Yeah, I think they keep getting up. Oh, can't go in there. Well, that's pretty creepy. Oh God. Fire station and church? No, we gotta make our way to the medical clinic, I think. I mean, let's see what's here though. Kinda curious to see if there's something here. I don't think anything ever told us to go to the church either. I just, I just, or the medical center. I just remember that's what this game's all about. Can't go in there. Oh shit! Oh, oh, that scared the shit out of me! Holy god! Oh, that doesn't look good. Got an apartment gate key. Well, that's probably useful. Apartment gate. Like here? No. This is definitely scarier than I remembered. 
a lot of it's because I, I, re I remember though not being able to see and I, I feel the same way it's very hard to just see what's what it's even going on what the was that noise uh yes yeah, so I guess we've got to go right Oh god, creepy, creepy, creepy. Did that hit me? There's a memo pad on the ground. I'm going to write everything that I've learned so far. Maybe that'll help you somehow. If you're reading this, it probably means I'm already dead. Am I, am I taking damage from that? Status? I can't really tell what that means. I'm bl It's blinking. Is that bad? Probably. Oh, another dead end. Oh, no. This is the wrong way. This is so creepy. I don't remember there being this many enemies. Another thing attacking me. Yeah, I think I just have to keep going. Blue Creek apartment. There might be that might be what that key was for. Was for that place. That's not good. Let's say the story that wakes in darkness, opening nightmares. Locked. What that key I have. Can't use it. Well, I guess it's not for. Not for here. Oh. Got it. Garbage. No use for that. I think there's a flashlight you could find. I think that'd be really useful. It might have been earlier in the... I might have missed it. I feel like it's something I probably should already have. I can't see anything. Got health or something. Woodside apartment, first floor. I'm going to look real quick to see um, when you get the flashlight. I feel like this really, it looks like I, like I probably was supposed to already have it. No. Flashlight. I 
Oh, so the, the flashlight will attract monsters. Room 205, the Woodside Apartments. Oh, so actually I wasn't supposed to find it yet. It's in here on the second floor. All right. Good. Bro, I can't see anything. It's crazy. Those lights I can turn off. Does that help me? Not really. I straight up cannot see. I might have to turn my streaming lights off. Yeah, let me turn those lights off. Okay. That's a lot better. Still dark as hell, but... We're on the second floor, maybe? Garbage shoot? Grass shoot. Yes, yeah, there's definitely puzzles and stuff in this game. It's coming, right? This is scary as hell. I can't see anything. Oh, some light. Dude. That end. Oh, so 205 is where the flashlight is. So it looks like I, I don't think I can even get to 205 from where I am. Bitch. Well, I don't think I kills them. Well, I wish I had the flashlight. What is that? I got a flashlight! 
Oh, fuck! Do I run out of batteries from the flashlight? The arms and legs scattered all over the sofa. Another side door. Door open. Okay. I think I passed other doors too, which isn't ideal. God, I can't see shit. I got something. What do I get? I'm almost dead, I think. Health drink. Handgun bullets, that's nice. Wooden plank, flashlight, radio. Let's have one of those. I don't even know if I can hit that thing when it's on the ground. I think I can't. nothing in there bring it on Looks like the lock is broken. I can't open it. Looks like the lock is broken. Can't open it. Great. Can't see. Pretty, pretty spooky game. Scarier than I remembered. Stretch my arm out, might be able to reach it. We pick it up, yes. 
Something scary gonna happen? Oh, you jerk! Wow, what a jerk. Alright, can I go this way? Can't, won't let me look. Don't know. Yeah. Lock's broken. Cart. Got a handgun. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Walls pockmarked with gunshots. Well, that's not great. I only have 10 rounds right now, so I don't think I'm going to utilize my handgun for the time being. I think I have to go back downstairs. stuff to find in the first floor we should go down the first floor and look really look there's the exit you know what I'm actually gonna call it um I know I played this game about 45 minutes but there's a save point uh tomorrow I'll be able to play and I'll be able to like start a lot earlier and get a lot more done so we're, that's what we're gonna do we're gonna pick this back up tomorrow thanks for watching and i'm gonna actually look at uh read a little bit about this game like what i'm supposed to do and stuff like that because I, I i think i did i think i might have used guides to beat this as a kid i feel like i wouldn't have had the patience to figure out where to go and stuff back then but i know i did beat it so all right thanks for watching i'll hang out with you guys next time and yeah we're probably not gonna have our camera on for ourself since it's just i need to have all these lights off to be able to see what's going on in the game so all right see you guys <sighs> yeah so even with um even with the my lights off it's still pretty dark but i do have this flashlight my understanding is that i missed like tons of health items and stuff throughout the game and tons of like um handgun ammo and stuff like that i missed like just lots of stuff so oh i didn't even know this door was here let's see what's in here well well guess not so i think i do need to go back on the second floor I think it's some kind of like puzzle or something I have to do in here. So let's try to find it.
locked. Locked? Really? Well, not this way. Tank controls, these old school 3D games. Huh. So we got these rooms here. Those rooms straight. I mean, I guess let's try going left first. I've already been here before, but I think there's something now that I have the handgun. And what was that? Some kind of noise north of here. Broken lock. Broken lock. Creepy as hell. Oh, I don't remember this TV being on in this room when I was here before. Oh god, this is creepy. Very cool though. Can't see shit. There's a clock. Well, before we mess with the clock, let's check out the TV. We got we got something. Three needles stand of three different heights: the fat, the tall, and the thin. From slow to fast, they move to the right. Scott rests not on three but fifteen. So Scott, from what I remember this puzzle, I think Scott is like seconds. So we gotta find the other clues. Is there more clues? No. All right, so let's try to remember that, that we got 15 seconds. Oh, there's a dead dude there. That's great. Okay. Key to room 202. Awesome. That's huge. This guy, what, he blew his brains out or something? Oh, is he still alive? Is it going to attack me? Oh my God. <sighs> oh, it's not. He's dead. Who could have done this? Newspaper here, it looks like it's very old. Okay. Okay. Uh, this is why I just looked at, right? Yeah. Okay. All right, so let's go back in the room with the clock. So we know the seconds, but we don't know anything else. Maybe room 202 might have more clues. Wouldn't be surprised. It's writing on here. Writing on the clock. The scars from the past shall remove the nail that stops time. But you push the clock. Sure. No matter how hard I push it, it doesn't move. It's like it's stuck to the ground. I probably have to solve the puzzle before um We can do that. Alright, so we know 15 seconds we know. Let's go to room 202 now. It is a lot easier to see with the lights off than it was yesterday. Yesterday was brutal trying to play this game. Anything here? No. Here's an enemy.
I think my radio's going off. Well, this is just alerting me if there's an enemy here. There's a way to kick him, but I don't know how. <sighs> there, I think I did it. Well, let's find room 202. So, next door on the left, after the stairs. I think this is it. Nope, that was the stairs. Okay. This must be 202. Can't see shit. The music's so creepy. Oh, there's medicine, I think, here. Hell yeah, health drink. Okay. Nothing inside this cage. There's nothing in here except for that. Well, that's pretty lame. Am I just missing something? It doesn't really look like it. Oh, I haven't been in here yet. What the fuck is that? Body of a dead butterfly is on the ground. There's nothing else of interest here. What is it? Clock key. Awesome. What's that noise though? So loud. There's got. I feel like there's got to be something here. I, well, I guess not. Oh, weird. We got the clock key, so we're probably good to get the fuck out of this room. Where's the exit?
See if we can do anything. I mean, I feel like we still don't have what we need to solve this clock thing. Yeah, that's pretty bad. This camera's rough. Okay, 15 seconds is what we want. We have the click, we have the key. Can't use it here. Hmm. Scratches on the floor of walls. It looks like something heavy was dragged here. Let's go. I mean, obviously, I could always look at a guide to figure it out. Rather than doing that, let's go explore more rooms again down here. We got 204 next, 205. Okay. I know I was in here already. Slow machine. Yeah, I missed something though. Look at all the shit blocking this door. Um, let's see if I can interact with it. I think whatever was in here, we already got. So let's get out of here. Looks like there's nothing else to do. <sighs> we got in here. I guess there's bad guys in here. Areas. Kind of annoying if you have to swap weapons like that to kill stuff, but I don't don't know of another way. Maybe if you shoot them, you won't need to kick them. But yeah, all right. So I probably wasn't in here before with the enemy running around. Probably not. Oh fuck! That scared the shit out of me. Kick it. There. Let's 
scared the shit out of me. Alright. Bathroom, sink. Oh, said something. Newspaper on the ground, nothing interesting written on it. Okay. Alright. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I've not been in here, so. Have I been in this room? No. I think it's just a like closet or something. Alright, what's over here? Uh, nothing. Is there just nothing in here? It's possible. It's over here. It's over this area. All right. I think this is the door I entered from. I think. So hard to see anything. Is there just nothing in here? I don't think I've been here yet, but it looks like there's nothing in this room either. No, it looks like there's just nothing in here. Hmm. That's really weird. I've been in here? I have. No, it's just nothing. Oh, handgun bullets. Okay. All right, so we got something. I don't even think I was in this little section of room at all. All right. So hard to navigate, so hard to see. I don't think the whole game's like this. I think it does open up later and it's a little bit easier to navigate, but I have no idea where to go. No. Trying to find the exit now because I think I think the hang on bullets were like the one thing in this room. There we go. All right. What's down that way? So room two ten, two eleven, two twelve. This is the last door. Alright, so there's nothing else. Didn't seem like there was a way to open up that clock. So let's go back to the third floor, I guess? Yes, yeah, so we go straight. Yeah, we'll go to the third floor and just dick around over there some more and see if maybe we miss something up there. I mean, obviously, we have to do something with that clock. Oh, I don't think I've been in here. Washing machine. Trash chute. Some kind of strange garbage stuck in the hole. All right, so we have a way to knock that down. I'm sure we need some kind of item or something that we don't have. All right. Yeah, let's go upstairs again. And, you know, if I have to use a guide, I will. I just really rather not for a game like this. But if I have to, I have to. Because we're getting close to where there's nothing left to even explore. We couldn't even interact with the clock to try to guess what the puzzle to try to guess the answer. It wouldn't even let us like interact with it. Oh, sounds like there's enemies up here. Locked. Is there not, just not a lot of stuff up here? 
Uh, it looks like we can only really go to this like one room. Yeah, we might have to look at a guide. So we got two doors. Let's check this door. Right, it opened. Full of holes. This is probably where we found the gun. That's what I'm thinking. Pockmarked with gunshots. Yeah, I think this is where we found the gun. There's probably nothing else in this room. Since obviously the gun's a pretty important item. Right. Nah, there's nothing else in here. Alright. We got one more door, and then I think I'm going to use a guide. Because now I'm, out of, I'm just out of... There's nowhere else for me to go. No, no other rooms for me to look in, so there's just something I'm not figuring out. And that's locked, too. Alright. Let's take a quick gander at a guide. Um, and just see... You know, see what there is. Um. Okay, Silent Hill. Puzzle grandfather clock. Perfect. But all right, we'll um. All right, we'll we'll go back to two hundred eight. And and we'll um. See if we can figure out what we're doing wrong. We're manipulating the, um, the clock face and trying to access. Yeah, I know. It's very confusing because we, we definitely try, like, we use our logic and reasoning. And it just made sense that the clock key would open the clock. Like, just common sense. But it just, we, we couldn't do anything with it. Well, we'll try again. We must have been doing something wrong, I guess. I even tried going in my inventory to use it from the inventory and it wouldn't work. But, alright, where's 208? It's probably the other way. Yeah, so we gotta make a left at the hallway. Turn around, make a left at the hallway, and it's the last door on the right, I believe. Alright, you going here? Find the little entrance to the clock room, which I think is this. Yeah, here's the clock. So how do we open this? Clock key. Examine. Okay. Oh, now it's letting us use it. All right. We used it. Weird. So we want the seconds on 15, but it already is. Um. Let me see. Hmm. Oh, I think the 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 clues are all in this room. All right, so we'll look further. We'll look further into this room. That's what it sounds like, like the clue. I'm, I'm pretty sure we looked already. We had that one tip about the seconds.
read this again. Needles stand at three different heights. Fat, tall, and the thin. Scott rests not on three, but 15. Hmm. Seven o'clock? Like PM, maybe? I don't know. Something about something being etched into the wall. I just don't know. Where to go? Oh, there's something here. Henry Mildred Scott. Oh, so is Scott the minutes? Mace, no, it's gotta be seconds. So where's the other clues? Oh, you know what? There's an outline. Let's try to let's try to match this outline. Look. Here. No. No. Didn't do it. There we got it. No, no, we didn't get it. I thought that click was, was it. I was like nine, like nine fifteen, nine ten. I was getting clicks, but it didn't seem like it opened anything. Let's go back to nine. Got it. Hell yeah. But now that we're here, what do we do? Where are we? Two or nine. Okay. But what do we do? Oh, 
Oh, save point. Let's save. Health. Don't mind if I do. Another door. So we got a couple doors. Try this door first. Nope. Can't go in there. Let's double check this place. All right, looks like there's nothing else in here, so let's leave. Won't hurt to save again, actually. So we got the health thing. Won't hurt. Not at all. Door there. And this must be the gate that we saw. Alright, so there's not really anything except for this door. Imagine that door's locked. Be like, what the fuck do they want me to do? Oh, a ladder going to the rest of the third floor that we couldn't access. A ladder going down as well? Or, um,. It's down here. Nothing here. What about this door? Locked. Alright, so there's nothing. Go back up. But the third floor, we couldn't access most of it before, so that's actually a pretty big deal. Pretty interesting design. A simple puzzle, but pretty interesting design. I kind of dig it. All right, we're probably going to get attacked. We know there's enemies on the third floor that we weren't seeing. So. Okay. Okay. All locked doors. So there's two more doors on this hallway, and then we gotta make a left at the end. Oh, we got we got something in here. Uh what the hell is going on? Oh, the pyramid head boss guy that you can't kill. He's doing some creepy shit. Weird. away yeah, I think you encounter him like many times throughout the game and you basically just have to run away from him because I think you can't kill him until maybe the end of the game you can kill him but 
Courtyard key, nice. Okay. Painting hanging on the wall, it looks like a landscape of this area. Okay. What's he even doing to these things? Well, looks like there's nothing else really for me to do in here. We got we got a key. That's probably it. So let's go back out here. All right, so there'll be a room straight across and then two more rooms to the left. Oh, we got something in here. Health drink, nice. Looks like there's something else in there, but we can't access it. I can't see nothing. Phone doesn't seem to work. First aid kit, nice. See shit. Kick. Kick. Shit. He wasn't down. I can't tell because I can't see. I can't see anything in here. Definitely a criticism of this game though. I just I just can't see. It's just so dark and the angles are so bad. I think we died. I mean, it's really not my fault um, because it's a mechanics issue of the game. Of I'm I that I defeated the enemy and there's just no way for me to attack him down. Let me um look it up. Silent Hill Two. How to attack? Okay. 
We weren't doing that. We were holding R2. So tap or hold X. All right. Maybe it'll work with the uh, the piece of wood. Probably. All right. So last time we saved it, we grabbed the health potion. Um. I think now we have to explore a couple rooms. Yeah. Yep. So we gotta go this way. We don't need to bother going downstairs. We already learned that. That was our first time dying. I don't think we're super low health. I think we just must have been taking a lot of damage with our way we were just like standing next to the thing as it was killing us. go i think there's like a, like a health potion in here or a key or something there's like one like thing in here oh, there's a key there's a key in the closet where we're just in i don't think there was a health potion in here i think that was the next room but let's just Double check real quick. Yeah, no, nah, there's nothing else in here. That's it. All right, let's get out of here. Right, and this is where we died. Yeah, I think there's a health potion in here. And a first aid kit. So the room on the right, we actually didn't find anything. We don't really need to bother with that room. Yeah, I think that's it. Did we leave? Yeah, let's not even fight that thing. Let's just go. There's nothing else in here for us. Dude, open the door. Holy shit. Alright. Good. I want to go this way. Out the gun. Yeah, we're about to die. Use most of our ammo. Tap it. There we go. The courtyard key. We probably have everything we need. I think there's something we're supposed to do with the garbage chute, actually. The garbage chute in the that we found earlier. I think we need to do something with it. The hell?
before we try to leave, let's see what's in this way. A hallway. Oh, a couple rooms. Okay. Can juice. I think that's probably what I need to, um, for the garbage chute, I bet. Now I gotta find my way back to the other side of, I guess, the second floor or maybe the third floor? I don't remember. Let's see if my courtyard key opens this. Now it's unlocked. Yeah, so it does. Alright, so we can leave now. We can get out of here. But, I think I wanna do something with that can juice first. This might be one enemy left alive. I think there is. Ah. How hurt are we? Not too bad. And hopefully enemies aren't all like respond. That'd be really annoying. This way. Okay. Well, that's different music. It's probably not good. Or different noises. I think the chute is probably all the way in the last floor. I might have, I probably have to go back to the third floor. Let me just see. It might be right here, actually. Actually, looks like it is right here. Find that juice. Alright. Now let's go back down the stairs. And see what we got.
It was a shoot. Is it through this way? I just used the courtyard key to open that. Well, that's good. Where'd that shoot go to? Hmm. I know I've seen the other side of it. Let's save. Hmm. I don't know. Where where does that shoot go to? Well, this isn't it. Could it be up a level? I don't think so. No. Yeah, no. Could it have been on the other side? Were I just like unlocked? I don't think that makes sense either. I think it's gotta be somewhere over here. Could the garbage shoot have been out could the garbage shoot have been outside? I mean it would kind of make sense. Look at the guide again. Uh oh. I'm hurt of my really hurt. Damn. Suits in here. The hell is that? Could have done this. The hell is that noise? Handgun bullets, nice. Hell? 
Weird. Walls covered with football posters and meaningless graffiti. Walls covered, okay. Alright. Really weird. Yeah, like I said, I did beat this game long, long time ago, but I really don't remember it very well. So long ago. I think it's probably all that's in this room. Let me see what it says about that garbage chute. What 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 was I supposed to do? What did, what did I miss, if anything? One second. Um. Hmm. Okay, garbage chute. Okay, checking your map. If you head west, you'll reach the west entrance when you first access the apartments, and you have some new items to use on your second go around. You may notice the bottom of the garbage chute to the right of the entrance. Garbage is still stuck in the chute, so take a look at your inventory, see if you have anything. How about. Okay. Remembering the business end of the chute outside. Head back down to the lobby and exit to find it around the right corner. Okay, so let's go back. Uh, so it was outside. It was the end of the I remember seeing the, the other part of the shoot. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, fuck. So we're here. So is that the courtyard on the left? If so, that's where I want to go. I want to go back outside and find the other end of the garbage chute because there are items we're supposed to get. Yeah. So let's try to find this garbage chute. Mm. 
Am I hurt? Nah. I don't think going this way is the way. this way I think uh, I think it's right around here yep garbage bag is torn contents are strewn all over I got a coin old man Gossip Magazine. Police surround announced today that Walter Sullivan, who was arrested on the 18th of this month for the brutal murder of Billy Locane and his sister Miriam, committed suicide in his jail cell early on the morning of the 22nd. What was the name of the guy we just talked to? I forget. According to the police statement, Sullivan used a soup spoon to stab himself in the neck, severing his or car car carotid artery. By the time the guard discovered him, Sullivan was dead with blood. From blood loss, a spoon buried two inches in his neck. An old schoolmate of Walter Sullivan's from his hometown of Pleasant River said he didn't look like the type of guy who would kill kids, but I do remember that just before they arrested him, he was blurting out all sorts of strange stuff, like he's trying to kill me, he's trying to punish me, the monster, the red devil, forgive me, I did it, but it wasn't me. The schoolmate then added, I guess now that I think of it, he was kind of crazy. Okay. Alright, now let's go back in. We'll save it. And then we'll make our way back to those rooms we were just in. So I've actually never played the original Silent Hill, and it's really expensive to buy it right now. And it's not available in any collection or anything. So, all right. So I don't think I've gone straight down the hallway, nor have I gone that this way. I think I'm, I have a lot to explore. Let's board it up. Can you get it open? There we go. All right, took care of that pretty smooth. Let's see what's in here. Really need more handgun ammo. Some kind of book. Okay. I am starting to enjoy this game now, actually. It wasn't at first. Handgun bullets, excellent. There might be there might be nothing else in here. I would not be surprised if this this was all that this room had. Yeah, that's it. Nothing else in here. Alright, let's get out. And then there's this room. Now it's unlocked. More courtyard? Well. And there's another hallway too as well that we didn't explore. Right, so this is a stairwell going up. So let's not go up there yet. Let's explore that other hallway first. All 
No, oh, well, okay. No. And back to it. There's a third floor as well. Well, I think we've been here. We're back to the clock. Okay. Let's see what's in the third floor. But th this way, I think this way was... I don't think we're gonna... F I think we gotta go back out to the courtyard. I don't think there's anything here. I think we're done. I think we're done this building, actually. Yeah. Yeah, we've been here. Yeah, we're done in this building. All right, let's go back outside and go to that like pool area where there's enemies and see what um what we could do from going like around there. Okay. Yes, yeah, I think this building is just done. Am I on the second floor? Somehow I am. Weird, but okay. Go up here. Well, that's bad. What we get? That's something. All right, let's get out of here. I don't think there's anything else for us to even get. How hard are we? Oh, it's probably the area that we were just in. Hold on, let's read that again. Meet Eddie, which we've already met. Fire escape door on the second floor. Yes, yeah, so that's our destination. Find the fire escape door. On we're supposed to have another key, it says. Do we have another key? We might not. We might have missed the, whatever wherever that is. Let's see. Flashlight. Coin, coin, handgun. Hammer. No, we don't have. We're missing whatever key they're talking about. We don't have. So let's backtrack and see where this key is that we don't have. Uh, 
fire escape key. All right, let's go. Fair enough. And then we gotta get to the second floor fire escape. Just go all the way straight down. Should we should get there? I think. Fire escape key. Okay. Now let's go back down to the second floor again. This way. Go down here. And alright. Now we gotta find the fire escape. I don't remember seeing a fire escape, but check out the map and see if anything looks like a fire escape. Uh hmm. Not uh it's probably this. So let's go all the way down and then right and then all the way down. And that might be right. Oh, uh, well, I guess we're, I guess that's not an option for us. I think this will get us through. I think this is that room with the clock. I think. So is it? It is. All right. So go through the little tunnel we made, moving the clock. This creepy ass room. Can't see shit. I can't see nothing. Uh, all right, there we go. Back in the hallway. Okay, now let's go left as far down as we can and then right all the way down and I think that might be that might be where we need to go I'm not sure but it's our best guess for now and all the way down this way maybe this is it yep we were right now I don't know what I don't know what to do from here, so let's just see what's here. Oh god, something's happening. I guess he has to jump. Maybe they knocked it down when they built the building. I think I can get into the building next door if I go through the window in front of me. So is that the hospital? Is that building the hospital? We're officially done with that first apartment building, so that's good. Oh, it's brighter. We can see, kind of. All right. An old, broken down bed. Yum. It's awesome. Uh. Looks like there's something stuck inside the toilet. We take it out. Yes. Gross. A wallet a memo in it 16 9 14 16 sounds like a safe combination so well, that's good 
Alright, now I can't see shit. Health? Not bad. Is that a safe? It is. Alright, let's look at that, uh... Let's take a look at that uh, memo again. I don't have a map of the area. Oh, cool. So we need to find a map of here. Uh, memo. Sixteen nine four sixteen. Sixteen nine four sixteen. Sixteen nine four sixteen. Sixteen nine four sixteen. Sixteen. This is pretty cool. Sixteen. Oh, I messed up. Sixteen nine four sixteen. Sixteen nine four sixteen. Sixteen nine four. Hang on bullets. Hang on bullets. Hang on bullets. Hang on bullets. Oh, baby. Well, I mean, in that case, let's equip the handgun. Because we've got bullets for days and days and weeks and months and years. That's awesome. We'll find a save point. Did it hit me? I think it might have. Eh, maybe not. Load. We fucked that thing up. Water. We don't have any map though, so we don't really know where we are. Lock's broken. I'm definitely starting to enjoy this game a little more than when I first started playing it. Still would like to be able to see a little better. Just a little bit. Emergency exit could be useful. There's a door on the left. Another shoot of some kind? Doesn't look like we can interact with any of the things in this room. Locked. Well, that makes it easy. Can't go can't go either way. What was that noise? No suck the door. Dear Tim, I have to run an errand, so I'm going out. I left the house key with Uncle David. You know where he lives, don't you? The key's in the room near the first floor staircase. Key's in the room near the first floor. I'll be back as soon as I can, so please watch the place while I'm gone. Key's in the room near the first floor. Am I on the first floor? I think I'm not. What the fuck is that? Bitch. Well, that was easy. Locked. Everything is locked. Holy shit. Locked. I'm actually... I think I checked every door. First floor. 
Was there a stair? Staircase? Oh, here we go. We, we haven't been in here. Well, the stair well, stairway going up. But let's go down because there's a key or something near somebody's room. So we're gonna go down. It's creepy as hell. There's a door there. And there's a door here. What the hell? Something hit me. First aid kit, nice. A lot going on. I don't know what the enemy was that attacked me. I need a map of this place. Nothing in bullshit looks like it'll be any use. Okay. Oh, we got something. Something written on the desk. Three bright coins in five holes. B at one end sits the seducer of the wind from behind the woman doth play. The formless one, Noel, lies furthest from they. The old one beside the serpent sits not. Uh, so we have an old man co coin and we have a serpent coin. Tis to the prisoner's left. All right, so we're missing one coin and there's like a... Po okay. Line of five one inch round impressions. All right, so this is where we put deposit the coins. We have two out of the three that we need, and two of the holes are going to be empty. Cool. I like I like um those kinds of puzzles. That's cool. Just gotta get the last coin though. Oh, save point. Don't mind if I do. I'll probably play the like, I'll probably play a little longer. I'm getting thirsty though. There's probably nothing else in this room, but we're in a big area. Oh wait, there's something here. Oh no, that's the thing I just looked at. All right, let's go back into the hallway. Let's go back the other way. What? What is it? A bug? It hit me like twice, and it didn't seem to really damage me much. Not that I could tell. Let me let me take a like a. Let me just take one of these. It was some kind of like bug. All right, we haven't been this way.
Handgun bullets, beautiful. Interesting looking door. I'll be back. Oh. Oh, we got something going on here. Oh, it's you. Yeah. That's a girl we met in, in the uh, graveyard towards the beginning of the game. this a lot. Music. Sure. No problem. If I kept it, I'm not sure what I might do. Uh. <sighs> what? Crazy. Crazy lady. Got the prisoner coin. So I think now we have all the coins. 